Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of the TCG Pack War, episode number 80, you guys. That is just crazy. I can't believe we've done 80 Pack Wars so far. Time goes by so fast, you guys. Just 20 more, and we reach that 100th Pack War, you guys. I can't wait. And I want to thank you guys for watching my Pack Wars. Also, my loyal subscribers, thank you for being loyal and watching my Pack Wars. I really do love making the pack wars because i get to see a lot of different cards from different sets so that's why i just love these you guys and i hope you guys do too but enough about that you guys let's just jump straight to the pack war and see what we get today and like always i got shinobu here in the corner to bring us good luck so as you can see you guys like oh we got pokemon Yu-Gi-Oh, dragon ball super y shorts vanguard and one piece you guys the full house so let's get started Okay, and like always, I start with Pokemon. As you can see, we got the newest set, Surging Sparks, you guys. You guys, for those who know, I don't have the best luck when it comes to Pokemon, but hopefully today we get some good pulls. Surging Sparks, the best card in the set is, of course, the illustration rare of Pikachu. Let's see if we're lucky today, you guys. And for those who are new to my pack wars, I always have two winners. Best card overall, in my opinion, and best waifu card. So let's see. I don't have the best luck when it comes to Pokemon. So let's see what we get. Come on. Anything good? Give me something good. Exitor. Nice. Classic. Anything? Cute Vulpix. Beautiful. And I see something. Nice. It's just a regular hollow foil, but it's okay. I'll take it. Togekiss. Nice. Pretty nice. Not much today for Pokemon. But I love this Vulpix. Man, cute little Vulpix. I love Vulpix. Okay, that's Pokemon. Let's, let's move on to Yu-Gi-Oh! The latest set. Quarter Century Bonanza. Dude, you guys, I apologize. I did not buy a booster box for this, you guys. A little bit overpriced. And just for reprints, I may just have to buy singles for this one. Of course, I wanted to open up... A box, but unfortunately I couldn't, you guys. Very pricey. But let's see. I have not seen these cards, so bear with me. I'm going to see for the first time. Oh my god, these are beautiful. No wonder they're overpriced. These cards are just beautiful. Look at that. Now I have some regrets, but let's just move on with it. Let's see. Miracle Contact. Beautiful card. Grave of the Super Ancient Organism. Pretty cool card. Of course, the thing to pull in these packs is a quarter century rare. That's super lucky. Mermel. Abyssus. Pretty cool. Polymerization. Nice. Ooh, look at that. Beautiful. Hey, that's a collector's rare. That's beautiful. Wow. That is just awesome. And here, it's a beautiful waifu. Sky Striker Ace. Shizuku. Like I said, there's going to be a lot of reprints. Just have very beautiful rarities. Dude, look at that. We got a collector's rare, I believe. And this beautiful waifu. Beautiful set, you guys. Now I have some regrets not getting the booster box, but it's okay. I'll just buy some packs along the way. Let's move on to Dragon Ball Super Fusion World Raging Roar. I guess the best card in this set, just putting my boy Goku, Super Saiyan 4. Let's see if we're lucky. King Yama. Dr. Mew. Bobbity. Tapo. Majin Buu. We got Buu again. GT. Great Saiyan Man. Boma. Don't care for him. We got Cell. We got Cell again as a rare. And 10 times Kamehameha as a rare. Not much today for Dragon Ball. Not much at all. Okay, you guys, let's move on to some Y Schwartz, one of my favorite sets. The Fruit of Grisaya, you guys. This set has beautiful waifus. Cannot complain with this set. I love the anime as well. Look at that. Waiting to be love, Amane. My own will, Sachi. I'm not a child, Makina. Overly caring wife, Amane. Cool, cool. Class representative, Sachi. After School Sunset, Yumiko. Oh, I love this one. I love the art of this one. Annoying Sundere, Michiru. Love Michiru. Here is a rare, Onipotent Kazuki. 
pretty nice. Love that show that shine. And here is a Climax Night of the Summer Festival. That is a rare for the pack. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Okay, you guys, Vanguard. I love this set. The Lyrical Monasterio Trick or Trick. Oh, this pack, you guys. It's just wife of galore, you guys. Beautiful cards. Look at that. Nice. Beautiful. You can't be disappointed with Vanguard Trick or Trick set. Beautiful cards. Monette. Like Utopia Nordy. Ooh, I see something in the back. For a rare, sturdy, sweet meal. And look at this beautiful card. A frame rare, I believe. That is just awesome. Beautiful card. I definitely know what's the waifu winner for today, you guys. Bustling Street Olga. Beautiful card, you guys. That. That needs a sleeve. Hold up, you guys. That is worthy of a sleeve. Um, just let me get my sleeve right here. Just a regular clear sleeve would do it. Beautiful. Oops, backwards. Look at that. That's just gorgeous. For sure. And you guys, last but not least... One Piece, one of my favorites, is Awakening of the New Era. The card to get is, of course, the manga rare of Luffy. But what are the odds? Which is one pack. Okay, guys. Wish me luck. Hopefully we pull it. It'll be so awesome if I do, but I doubt it. Come on, Shinobu. Give us the luck. We got my boy, Chopper. Holly, don't care for him. Kuma, my dude. Don't care for him either. Come on, give me something good. We got Pell. Monet, cute Monet. Anything? No, we got x trick as a rare. And last card, nothing. Karatsu, I don't even know who that is. I don't care. You guys, that is it for this pack where episode number 80 has come to an end. And like always, I must pick a winner. Honestly, it's a very easy win, you guys. Let's do the obvious best waifu card, in my opinion. Vanguard takes that win, you guys. Look at that beautiful card. And it's a frame rare, you guys. That is just beautiful, you guys. Not gonna lie. That, it's a beautiful card. Best waifu right there. And best card overall, in my opinion. Giving it to Yu-Gi-Oh. We managed to pull a collector's rare. Of polymerization, you guys. That is just a classic. I'm just, the camera does not do it justice, but you can see that beautiful texture. You know what? This needs a sleeve. I should have sleeved this sooner. Hold up, my peoples. Hold up. That card is just gorgeous. Beautiful. Look at that. That is best card overall, in my opinion, for sure. It probably has no value, as in, like, you know, in price. Like I said, these are reprints. I'm pretty sure the price of that is not that expensive. But that card is just beautiful, you guys. It's a classic, for sure. And there you have it, you guys. Best card overall, in my opinion, and best waifu card. You guys, in the comment section below, let me know if you agree with my winners. If not, let me know who do you think won. In your opinion, what was the best card overall and what was the best waifu card? I really want to know. But yeah, you guys, like I said, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.